life and says, I can do anything that I want to do and still be feminine. Here at HSN, we base our retail values on nationwide information. Retail value is an indication of the price you would expect to pay for the same or similar item elsewhere, not the price at which you would be able to sell the item. Prices do vary around the country, so ours might be different from prices in your area. For more information, call one of our customer service reps at 1-800-289-3900. Attention, everybody. You are here for the official launch of Geek Chef here. <laughs> uh, we're really excited about this launch. They take things that we use in the kitchen and quite simply make them easier to use in the kitchen. What you are looking at is a four-in-one tilt head stand mixer. Don't turn the channel because you're thinking, uh-uh, I am not bringing a big, heavy stand mixer into my kitchen. Uh, this one is a compact design that is going to give you so much power, so you're going to enjoy Enjoy using this every single day. So we're launching it for you today at $10 off, either in the silver or we'll show you the red here in just a second. Um, also doing free shipping and handling, which is great. So Stephanie Roberts, hi girlfriend, Hello. nice to see you, honey. I love this because how many times have you either said, gosh, I really would like a stand mixer because it does the heavy lifting for me, but I don't want to pay hundreds of dollars. Or yeah. you have a stand mixer and it sits under the cupboards, you never get it out, it weighs a million pounds, and it's just too cumbersome. Yeah. So what Geek Chef has done is that they have come up with a compact mini stand mixer that is still mighty. So I love the combo of mini and mighty because I'm able to do my tough jobs. I have all the maneuverability that I want with the stand mixer, the tilt-in head, the ability to do the big jobs, and the power, because look at this. All right, I'm gonna be dangerous here. There is meringue upside down. This took us literally less than two minutes total to get absolutely gorgeous, stiff meringue from eight different eggs. So I like the fact that I'm not having to battle with a hand mixer, that the stand mixer can do the job. Let me tell you about Geek Chef. So Geek Chef is a brand new brand to us right here in America. And what they're trying to do is they're trying to make smarter appliances. So rather than like releasing an entire line of everything, they're kind of looking at what do we need to do better in the kitchen. Mm -hmm. And they looked at stand mixers and said, all right, listen, they're big, they're cumbersome. Yeah. People don't use them because they're such a pain to maneuver and yeah. deal with. So let's make one that's user friendly. Let's make one that has all the power, none of the weight, but yet you can do so many different things with it. So the reason it's called four in one is there's actually four different ports, if you will, yeah. where you can attach things, whether it's a food processor on top, a blender in the back, a meat grinder in the front. I have totally transformed this stand mixer in Look front of your that. eyes here. Wow. It does all sorts of different things. But what we're talking about today is using it as more of a basic stand mixer okay. where we used our whisk feature yeah. to do our gorgeous pie. Uh -huh. Now let's use it for the savory things because you were saying something smelled good. I think I know what it is. So we put some <laughs> red skin potatoes in here, okay. piping hot too. I like the fact that because I'm dealing with all aluminum here, not plastic, I can work with hot items. I've got a great 2.6 quart stainless bowl here. And I'm gonna go ahead and make mashed potatoes because if there's one thing that is not overly fun to work with when we do it in our hand mixer, it's definitely mashed potatoes. So I've got my red skins in here. I've got my stainless steel paddle there doing my work breaking up the potatoes, but this also comes with a pour shield. So if I want to add a little cream, all right, I admit, going a little unhealthy by adding cream, but it is going to taste absolutely fabulous. And you know what? This is the kind of thing you want a stand mixer for, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Because if you've done this by hand, it's not fun. I've right. blown up a motor in my beaters before sure. trying to do this with a hand mixer. So much, much better to add a little liquid. So use a pour shield, I'm gonna crank this up. Look at all the speed control I have here, by the way. Seven different speeds. 
Well, and notice that all the way up to Max. Talking. Oh, it's, well, it's, it's running, not right? It's obnoxiously oh my loud. Gosh, mine is like so loud. I would. <laughs> but you can't run it when the baby's sleeping, it, right? Exactly. You don't want anything like this. And by the way, has a pulse feature as well. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. So um, you're looking at all the different things you have there. That let me show you it. what you're getting. You choose either the red or you choose the silver. Both of them are available for you at ten dollars off today. Um, you get the stand mixer. You get the bowl. You get the dough hook. You get the beater, the whisk, the pouring shield, and then you also get recipes included with your purchase with free shipping and handling as well. What a fabulous opportunity going into baking season. You know the fall is here. I We're going to be doing some baking. A lot of us, I mentioned, I have a stand mixer. This thing is, I, I mean, it's two hands. It's so heavy that I don't get it out of the pantry, to be honest with you. Exactly. So therefore, you're probably using your hand mixer to do things like mashed potatoes, like sweet potatoes, like spinach balls, the appetizers for the football season. You yeah. know, everything is better when it's cream cheese based. That's one of my theories in life. But how hard mm. is it to work with the cream cheese, with the spinach? Mm. Isn't that wonderful? I didn't that even get to the butter and the chives, and you're already in there. <laughs> you, I'm not going to stop you. Go okay, ahead. Okay, yeah, we're going to go ahead and finish it off. <laughs> oh, but see, that's good. the thing. When you say stand mixer, you do tend to think first of fall baking, of the Christmas cookies, of the bread. But think about the everyday uses. And that's what Geek Chef is trying to do. You were talking about weight. Okay, I gotta show you this. One hand, 11 pounds. I mean, I can literally wave this around. Could you do this with your stand mixer? No, it's, it's a two-hander. It is, and it's yeah. cumbersome, and people don't do it. I'm afraid I'm so, going to drop it. It's so heavy. Exactly. Yeah. So you're getting the quality. You're getting the power. 550 watts, seven different speeds, plus pulse. But look at the fact that I'm waving it around in my hand. This is not a stand mixer that you have to keep tucked away and only haul out for the big jobs, right. you know? This is what I call your everyday friend. You get it out. You make your potatoes. You put a little more on you do a little fresh whipping cream for your desserts or even the everyday jobs that you dread in mm. my case anything involving raw meat I right. don't like making burgers I don't like I'm the same way okay now watch what we've done though okay. so we've put our meat mix in here in this mm. case I'm gonna make it into meatballs but you could do this with meatloaf you could do this when you're making a turkey slider because you know you need to put something in it to bind it together mm -hmm. well how do you usually get that to happen you squish it in your hands Right. I'd rather not. Right. So instead, I'm going to use my stand mixer. Raw meat is in there, some onions, some spices. I used a binder, an egg, a little bit of breadcrumbs. And I'm just going to go ahead and let this do the work for me. So I am not ushing and gushing the raw meat. And you know what? When you're trying to get your kids to get comfortable in the kitchen and help you out, they're a lot more willing to help when they're not having to ush and gush things either. Sure. By the way, how are those potatoes? <laughs> I keep going back and forth between that and the meringue. That's okay. It's, it's a different combination, but whatever know? makes you happy. <laughs> but both are well blended, are they not? They're perfectly blended, <laughs> yes. So look at what we are able to do here. We are able to then take our meat mm -hmm. that I have not touched, which makes me quite happy. And now, this is another good little cook trick. Use an ice cream scooper mm. and make your meatballs. So oh, then I'm, you're not touching it at all. I'm not touching it at all. All. And it just makes it so much easier to work with. I can do the same thing when I make sliders. I like the fact that we're using more ground chicken. We're using more ground turkey. But to be able to then get everything so well mixed, this right. is going to do such a better job mixing than I am. So we've shown you a couple of the different attachments. This, of course, being the paddle. We worked with the whisk for the meringue. All of the attachments work on what's called a planetary mixing structure. What that means to you is that I didn't have to scrape the inside of this bowl. I didn't pick this up and have onions all around the outside. Everything is evenly mixed inside the bowl. Literally, this little guy is doing all the work for me. It is mighty, yeah. but we like the fact that it is mini because it's just not taking up a ton of space. And again, it doesn't weigh any more than it has to. Well, and when you're done, all of the metal um, attachments, the bowl, all of it, it's all dishwasher safe. Absolutely. So there's literally, you just contained everything. It's all just right here. Wow. And so. remember, you're getting all the different attachments. Yeah. So while we stop by at the What You Get, of course, your choice of the red and the silver, but it's coming with your whisk, which mm -hmm. I would use for things like the whipping cream. Uh, what about quiche on a Sunday morning? Sure. Scrambled eggs, the basic Thing. You were like, oh, I just do those with a fork. Why would I want to get out my stand mixer? This is the first thing I did with my Geek Chef. I'll be honest, I have never owned a stand mixer. 
First reason is expense, hundreds of dollars. Yeah. Just, you know, you have to draw the line somewhere, I like right. to say. The other reason is space. space. I've never had the space to store it. Yes. So when I got my Geek Chef and I started working with it, I thought, oh, we'll just have eggs on a Saturday morning. <gasps> Do you know how much better they are? Oh my when gosh. they are whipped yeah. well yeah. and with a wire whisk done on so a stand mixer, so they were better. amazing. Yeah. Literally, I think I have four hungry boys. We went through 18 eggs. Like everyone wanted oh six because they were just like, they're so good, they're so fluffy. <laughs> so when you have something like this that's easy to work with, you yeah. get it out for those everyday yeah, you do. Yeah. That's why I like the whisk. So the paddle I use for the heavier things, the potatoes, the meats, the, you know, making the burgers, making the mashed potatoes, anything, the cookie doughs, mm -hmm. because we are still going to be doing a lot of baking, of course. But yeah. I want you to think it's not just for baking. It also works for the savories. And then there's, of course, the dough hook. And what we like about the dough hook is that... What's the main reason most of us don't make our own dough? Because it's a lot of work, right? You have to stir and stir and stir. So what I like about this is this has done all the work for me, and then suddenly we're having Friday night pizza time as a family, and we're making it ourselves. Look how easily that just slid off. We are yeah. talking high-quality materials here on absolutely every angle. And what else I like about this is... I am guilty of buying either ready-made pizza dough or, heck, half of the time it's a frozen pizza. I'm not going to lie. Yeah. You're busy. We do what we do. And it's because of time. But you know, how many ingredients are in pizza dough? Four. Wow. Flour, yeast, salt, and water. And that's it. Mm -hmm. So this is not difficult. I mean, anybody that can measure can make homemade pizza dough. And the kids will think it's a ball. Why don't we do it? Because it's not fun to sit there and stir and you stir and stir. You got that We don't have time well, to what? do it. Geek Chef just did all the stirring. Yeah. I don't have to do it. And look at this dough. I am ready to go. I mean, at this point, this is what we do at home. Everybody gets a little ball, right? And you know you keep your hands floured and you keep the kids floured up. But you teach them. You get your ball of dough, you pull it out, you make your own pizza, and you're making Friday, Friday night, night pizzas right? as a family. You know, and it's the easiest thing to do. Yeah. It's the so easiest. You don't give up power. You simply give up something that can be complicated, heavy, takes up space. You don't want to use it. I have, I mentioned to Stephanie, I have the big stand mixer, that really big popular one that um, was a wedding gift. It was mm -hmm. several hundred dollars, right? I get nervous when I think about taking it out. I love the idea of using it, but it is so big and so so heavy and such a pain. I like that this is compact enough that you can keep it on your counter if you want to. Absolutely. Uh, everything is dishwasher safe, so it's so simple and easy to use. But again, you're not giving up any power with this. Or quality. You know, and that's what Geek Chef is about. They'll make them space conscious because they know our space is at a minimum. We may be living in apartments and condos, but yeah. that doesn't mean we don't want to do these tasks. Mm -hmm. It's got the tilt head. It's got the easy replace attachments. Remember, you're getting three plus the pore shield. At first, I was like, well, I don't really need a pour shield. Makes such an incredible difference for getting things done. So they've kind of taken what we love, love about those high-end, big, bulky appliances yeah. and made it approachable so that we can all do it. All right, one thing we should all learn to do and do all the time, because, yeah. again, it's so easy, is right. making our own whipped cream. It's such a difference yes. in quality. So here's a great, agree. here's a great, you're like, please, make yes. it right now. Let's do that now. Here's a good chef tip, too. <laughs> Keep your bowl in the freezer okay. because you want it as cold as possible okay. to get the good chill. So whether it's fruit, whether it's cheesecake, no matter what it is, and let me tell you, this one gets cold because my fingers are now sticking to it because we're dealing <laughs> with high quality aluminum, which I like. left in the silver, by the way. Okay, great. We talked about the easy change attachments. Okay. You get several of them, you line it up, and turn, and that's it. So whether I'm putting on my whisk, putting on my dough hook, or working with my paddle, couldn't Easy. be any easier to do that. So then I take my cream, again, tilt head, right down in, go ahead and add my liquid. Now I am gonna start slow, just to get it going, because if you've never worked with a stand mixer, it takes a little bit of getting used to, just in terms of how it works. But do you see how it doesn't just spin? It spins almost, that's why they call it planetary, as if it is rotating around, because that's how it's getting to all edges of the bowl. That's speed three, four, five, six, and seven. Seven different speeds plus a pulse function. And in a matter of seconds, we end up with fresh whipping cream. Now, I've done this with my hand mixer until Geek Chef. I did it every single time with my hand mixer. At least 50% of the time, it's on the backsplash of my wall. Sure. And once it right. landed on the ceiling. Because oh, if God. you're doing a lot of it, and yes. you can't control it, that's what happens. Or if you're yes. doing it and then going to talk to a kid, like I often do, yes. it's great. I mean, it's yeah. one of the simpler kitchen tasks, yet how often do you actually make your own whipped cream? Well, uh, well, exactly. Or maybe you do. I know that my mom makes her own um, almost every day because they do the keto diet. So
so she does Perfect. it low carb. This is a wonderful way to add that healthy fat if you yeah. are doing one of those style diets. So this won't be keto friendly because I'm adding a whole bunch of syrup. But what I like <laughs> about it is that I'm adding some fruit flavor and some color. You can add fresh raspberry syrup and have it whip right into your whipped cream. Oh my Which gosh. is such a wonderful treat. Oh, right? And yes. you can have it be fresh and delicious every day. Exactly. So again, this is what these appliances are designed to do is let's take the chemicals out, let's take the preservatives out, and let's make it something that we do ourselves. You know what I love about Carrie is that she is standing by with a fork in her hand. Always. <laughs> and digging, uh -huh. and Always. digging right in. So you get to be a little more creative as well because mm. you're doing all these different things. You num, taste num, the num. raspberry? Yes. Yeah, it's good to have a little extra fruit in there. Oh, I like wow. that. So again, easy replace attachment, mm. so easy to work with on every level. Geek Chef wants to yeah. make the kitchen approachable. You know, you don't have to spend a fortune. You don't have to take up a ton of counter space, but you do have to have quality. It's one thing to downsize your appliances, but you've got to make sure you still have the power and you still have the ability to have great results. And yeah. you know what? In just seconds, that to me is a pretty yummy result. So you're getting the beater, the whisk, the dough hook, and the pouring shield. They are dishwasher safe, so this is so incredibly easy for you to use. By the way, it stays put on the countertop as well. It's not dancing around. Um, we were talking about how it's quieter than other mixers. We Absolutely. were actually still able to have a conversation standing <laughs> here. It's a more compact design, so maybe you have a mixer. That's another thing. My stand mixer is not out on the counter because it doesn't fit. Oh, because it's under, too tall. It's too tall, yes. absolutely. So this is no one that's gonna here. fit underneath the counter. You mentioned um, jumping around. I do yeah. wanna mention that it's got rubber feet yeah. on the bottom, so it's designed to stay put, but you do notice it's no problem to go grab it. It doesn't, I have a couple things with those rubber feet where literally it suctions so hard down, I know. you can't get it off. Right. So that's not good at all. But this is the perfect blend of secure. Again, we've got aluminum, not plastic as our housing. Yeah. But again, I'm one-handing it. When have you seen a stand mixer? and it's not like I'm a bodybuilder, that you can just hand And hand she put the other one behind her back. That's right. Like, I'm doing it with one serious. outside behind my back. When you're in the ordering process for this, know that we protect all of your um, equipment and electronics and things that you buy here at HSN with HSN Protection Plus. So if anything were to happen, if you were to damage it, we've got your back. So you can read more about that on hsn.com or ask your representative about it. Also, um, if you want to use your HSN card to get this home, that's a great way um, to get this home still using the those fabulous flexible payments and if you don't have the hsn card you can actually go to hsn.com read all about it you can apply and be approved during our show and you get to take ten dollars off all right i want to take a second and show you what we're doing here because this to me truly shows the quality and power okay. we have chicken breasts in here we literally threw big thick chicken breasts i cut them in half cooked and put them in there. Like Look. I turned away and I turned back and it was already and it ready was shredded. to go. Yeah. Like those were full chicken breasts. This is what we're doing here is literally we are shredding chicken breasts with the stand mixer. Wow. Now talk about something that turns this into my everyday friend. There right. is nothing I like less than having to usually work with hot chicken and try right. to fork it if you're making yes. pulled chicken, pulled pork. Think about all the things that you do this time of year yeah. for entertaining, for appetizers. We've yep. learned that the stand mixer and a good sturdy paddle makes quick <laughs> mix of this. So now I'm gonna go ahead and make our infamous buffalo chicken dip. And okay. this is my favorite part of fall. We can start to do the tailgating appetizer. So we've shredded the chicken. Again, I didn't do it. Geek Chef did it for me. Okay. I'm gonna add the rest of the ingredients for my recipe. I've got my buffalo sauce. I've got my ranch dressing. Okay. Go ahead and put in my cheese. And then what makes making these dips so difficult? Because you have to do the, the cream cheese too. So let's go ahead and add that right in as well. And you will notice that the mixer is going to do it. So when you're looking at your recipes and you have all those different recipes where you know that you have to, where it says cream this, beat this, do all the difficult things by hand, what you are able to do is let something like Geek Chef do it for you. Get yeah. your stand mixer out when you're making the batch of cookies. Yeah. When you're making that spinach casserole that you love but is so hard to whip the cream cheese in. Mm -hmm. So now that I've put it all in there, I turn it on. Okay, here's 550 watts doing its job. That's, that's on speed two. So I start a little slow. Look how quick that mixes in. Oh, that smells so good. Oh, it does it in the <laughs> buffalo sauce immediately <laughs> takes over. But this is something that is so much elbow grease for me if I'm doing it by hand. If you're getting to the point where, you know, maybe working with the spoons and the dexterity things gets a little tricky for you, or it's just too hard on your elbows, or too just much work, period, yeah. to want to make these things, this is what a stand mixer is good for. I mean, that made that look flawlessly easy. And I love it.
and then we're done. done. Yeah, and cleanup is a breeze because you're going to throw all the pieces in the dishwasher. Of course. Uh, notice we still had a conversation while that was going on because it wasn't Easily. super loud. Easily. It's just a more reasonable everyday size as well. I love the word reasonable, and that's exactly yeah. what I think Geek Chef is all about. They want to bring appliances to you that you are actually going to use. So that means they're a reasonable price point, they're a reasonable size, they're manageable in terms of how we work with them, but most importantly, you're actually going to want to use them because they do what they're supposed to do. I don't want to use a stand mixer if it doesn't have the power to do my dough, mm -hmm. to do my meats, right. but on the other hand, you don't have to have one that weighs 30 pounds to get the job done. Exactly. Um, two colors are still remaining, but if you want the silver, that's going to be your first to sell out. Um, otherwise, your other option is going to be the red. You get all of the beaters that you need, and we're even including recipes with your purchase today. So right out of the box, you're good to go. That looks amazing. <laughs> There's your yeah, buffalo looks dip. looks amazing. Take it to the party. Um, You'll be the hero. Yeah, I'm sure. Or... Or just dig get, it a, with a fork. get a fork and sit on the couch. That's <laughs> that works too. <laughs> um, thank you, honey. Good to Such see you. Such a pleasure having you here. All right, we'll stay in the ordering process. Brand new to HSN, and we're absolutely thrilled to bring this back to you. And speaking of thrilled, don't go anywhere because the one and only Kimberly Schlappman from Little Big Town is joining us next with her amazing Love and Daisy's cookware collection. We're going to get you baking with that three piece bakeware set. She's here. We're going to share some recipes. It's coming up for you in just a moment. Our Happy Place cleaning products are made with plant-based ingredients. Which means less chemicals in your house, which will make it a happy place. People think, can it work well? And it does. We chose plant-based ingredients so you're not breathing in fumes. You're not putting as many chemicals where your kids and your pets are touching them. There's a lot of great benefits to cleaning with our Happy Place products. If we can get your home clean, that's what makes your home a happy place. Love you we, so much. Love you to pieces. We go way back. We actually of. really do. We have a little history together. Back in the day, <laughs> before husbands and babies, yes, and all of yes. us just starting out. I wanted to do this with you forever, yeah. so I'm so happy we get to do it today. Same to yeah. you. Yeah. So yes, she's absolutely amazing, country music sensation uh, from Little Big Town. But you are also an amazing chef. Um, you bake. This is all something that you've grown up doing. You've been cooking and baking as long as you've been singing. I have. As soon as soon as I could stand up on a stool next to my mama in the kitchen, I was cooking. <laughs> Whatever she told me to do, I would do it. I just wanted to be a part of it. And it's been oh, such a passion of mine. I love to cook. Got a lot of recipes in the cookbook. We made some for you today. And we're here with this amazing three-piece bakeware set. Absolutely. And let me, and excuse me from stepping yep. around you because I want to be able to show everybody what you are getting. This is an incredible, highly durable, non-stick technology bakeware set. You're getting three pieces, so it's pretty much everything that you need to bake. Um, like I said, a number one top seller and a customer pick at $49.95. Lowest price, final quantity at $24.95, which is so fabulous. Awesome. Only about 600 of you can get this. So you're going to get that eight and a half inch non-stick square pan. You're also going to get the non-stick roasting pan and you're getting the non-stick cookie sheet. All three of these in the most beautiful rose tone, metallic, gorgeous look. I love that this doesn't look like most of the pans that I you know. pull out of your kitchen. It has um, such a beautiful rose gold color. It has this beautiful chevron pattern on the bottom, which is pretty, but also is very important to the non-stick capacity and the even heating mm -hmm. of the pans, mm -hmm. you're gonna get even heating. If you're if you're making cookies on the cookie sheet, you're gonna get the same color cookies on this side as you get on this side. You won't have yeah. different colorations of the cookie sheet. And the cleanup, here again, is a breeze. <laughs> so easy. Yeah, absolutely. So yes, that pattern is really beautiful, but that helps with the heat distribution, that helps with the airflow. It actually has a purpose to it. So that is something that you're going to be baking. I mean, I would throw a quick piece of salmon in there. 
Oh, I'm you can put anything in, the in these pans. Right now, I'm going to make what I call my lazy woman strawberry pie. I like from, this. From the cookbook. Okay. And um, which is super easy. If you want to impress somebody, if you pull out this recipe and bake this pie up real fast, uh -huh. you'll get anything you want. <laughs> okay, anything do tell. Anything you okay, want. Okay, so wait, this is available in your amazing That's in the cookbook. Book? Yes, it's okay. called. Okay. Um, we're going to tell you more about the limited edition signed recipe book uh, that is available for you. We'll tell you more about it coming up. But what did you put in there? How many so, ingredients? So I've got butter in the bottom, and then I've got milk, flour, and sugar. And this is in the really sweet bowl set that we had out earlier. Uh -huh. And then I'm going to top it with some sweetened strawberries. And you literally, watch this, you pour it all over the top. You don't even have to stir anymore. You just pour it right over right the top. Right out of the bag. And this goes in the oven, and I'll be back in a minute. Okay. <laughs> How easy is that? Like, you it's literally so put the ingredients in. easy and yummy. Yeah. But you know what? When she takes it out, I hope I hope there's an already made one oh, in there. Oh, there's one. Okay, good. <laughs> this place is magic. There's definitely one. And then this is what happens. <gasps> Look how beautiful it is. That's and gorgeous. yummy, yummy, yummy. I'll how dip long did you bake that for? This goes for like 45 minutes, oh, okay. I think. Yeah. Okay. And um, and then it's it's heaven. And we've got some ice cream over here. Okay. Yeah, I'll dip you out some. And yeah. also, the one thing I love about this this great set is that, watch how this is just going to slide right out. Look at See? that. It's not going to, you're not going to have problems with it sticking. There's even yep. heating. See how beautifully brown it is all over there? Yeah. You like ice cream, Carrie? Okay, yes. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Okay, yes to everything. Who, who doesn't? Okay, this ice cream is really it's hanging like... on. So we'll just have it out a little bit of ice cream. <laughs> this is all I get. Um, this might be the, the hardest. What is going on? I think, it, I think it just came out of the freezer. I think it did. But it's pretty. <laughs> Freezer's turned out a little bit. This is one of my favorite goodies. And okay, yeah. so this is my go-to brownie pan. I happen to make mm. a lot of brownies at my house. This is my go-to brownie pan. This is my go-to sheet cake pan. Yeah. Or, um... You can make a whole ham or a whole chicken in this. Mm -hmm. And then this little, um, well, this big cookie sheet down here. My Daisy bakes lots of cookies. Does and that's she? her go-to. She loves well, that one. Let's try. I can't stop eating this. This is so, so good. Yummy, huh? Thank you for sharing this with yeah, us. This is, by the way, we're gonna take we're gonna give you the information for the cookbook that has that recipe in it. But let's mm. talk about the cookies because a lot of us we have the sheets and we try to take the cookies off. Yeah. And I want to show you cookies. something. Okay. If you just um I want to, first of all, look at this cookie and this cookie. They're the same color. Uh -huh. But all you need to do, a lot of times with cookies on a nonstick pan, they, they're, they're going to cook. They're going to stick. You just give these a little bit of a twist, mm -hmm. and they come right off. And look how pretty the bottoms are. Aren't they just Wow, they're gorgeous. perfect. Can you see that? They're yes. perfect, right? This is my husband's favorite, those peanut butter cookies. Yeah. Oh, I, oh yeah. How could they yeah. not be a peanut butter cookie? It's amazing. So yummy. But like you were saying, that chevron design, that actually helps with the heat. and it, The heat flow underneath and the even heating. And I want you to hear this. Okay. So yeah. it's a seriously yeah. he heavy-duty quality pan. These are the ones that you're going to buy and keep in your cabinet forever. You don't have to throw away them because, you know, they... they they are ruined after a couple of months. They're all black and rusty and all. These will hang around forever. Yeah, absolutely. Incredibly durable. Dishwasher safe. Please forgive me. I keep walking behind Dish you. Dishwasher but safe. Dishwasher That's safe. amazing. Yeah. Yes, dishwasher safe. But you know what's so great, Kimberly, is that a lot of us, we say dishwasher safe, but the cleanup is so easy because nothing sticks to these. Yeah. You can just wipe them out. Like You don't even have to worry about putting them in the dishwasher. You can literally wipe them out, yes, and, and they're, they're clean. If you want to throw them in, you can. Yeah. That's my little loving daisies. I, love um, I have two baby girls, uh -huh. and I named this for my older one because I didn't have my little one at the time. Uh -huh. <laughs> and her name is Daisy. Right over here, these are also in my cookbook, are some sweet potato fries. Oh, my. I don't know how hungry you still are, I'm Carrie. Just, <laughs> You're stuck. I will never turn You're down stuck. any recipe that you but make for me. Oh, my gosh. really yummy. Yeah. And in this pan, roasted vegetables, well, first of all, sweet potatoes have a lot of sugar in them, uh -huh. and often sweet potatoes will just stick, stick to pans, and so will lots of roasted vegetables. But if you'll watch this, and we just took these out of the oven, and look how they're just sliding around on the pan so easily. Oh, my God, those are good. Thank you. <laughs> Those are so amazing. Those are so Thank delicious. Um, I love that you did that because that seems to be the big craze right now is that mm. one sheet cooking. Roast and vegetables, yes. Oh my gosh, so good. Remember, these are $24.95, lowest price that it's ever been. So with our final roughly 400 of these to go around, 
wedding gifts, housewarming gifts, these are perfect for that because you have the most adva amazing advanced non-stick technology, incredibly durable, dishwasher safe, and they're just so beautiful. Aren't they so pretty? I that's love the what, color. That's what lo I love about them. They're not just your everyday bacon sheets. Absolutely. All right, well now let's talk about the book, and I'm so surprised that we have any of your cookbook remaining. Um, <laughs> this, okay, I just got an update. 700 of you can get the, okay, I'm sorry, did I just reach, sorry. I just took it out. <laughs> I wanted to pick it up for everybody. <laughs> um, this is Ogasi. This is full of recipes up from your family. Yes. So much Recipes from my mama and my grandmothers, and lots and lots of stories about growing up um, in the South, and, and then all the stories that, that raised me, and then all the way up into Little Big Town. Little Big Town stories are in there, all kinds of things, and um, it's, a, it's a special book. It's, a, it's kind of a, it's a, well, it's a cookbook, but it's also a memoir. It's really special. Oh, yeah, and it is hand signed just for yep. you. Limited edition on this. Can I just point out Georgia peach salsa? Yeah. I mean, just every page yeah. you turn to with full color pictures and amazing stories as well. So there's that autograph that you're getting along with this. Such a special thing to add to your order, uh, $6 and change using those flexible payments. Yeah, that's so, amazing. You can get it home for that. And I did I sign every one of them. So yeah. Absolutely. Well, we do have a special phone call. We are going to go out to the phones and say a big hello to Miss Daisy. Welcome into HSN. I think you know who Daisy is. Daisy Pearl. Hi. Hey, baby. Hi, Hey, darling. Oh. What are you doing? Um, well, I'm watching you. Well, hey. Mwah. I'll see you later tonight. I have missed you. Have you had a good day? Yeah, I have. Have you? Have been? you? I've had a super great day. This is my friend Carrie. Hi, Daisy. Hi. You've <laughs> never met Carrie, but I hope you will someday. Hey, let me ask yeah. you a question. Have you been cooking today? I'm about to, I'm about to make a grilled cheese on the grill pan. Oh, I knew it. She's always cooking. This kiddo is always cooking. Oh, Daisy, do you love to get in the kitchen and cook with your mom? I love to. Yeah, what are some of your favorite things to cook with her? Well, I love to make cookies. Yeah. She's, a, she's a cookie expert. <laughs> 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 oh, Daisy, you'll have to come next time. We would love to meet you. That would be so much fun. I, I have to bring you next time, baby. I really got to bring you down here. You'll love it. Yeah. Yay. I'll see you in a few hours. Make a really okay. good grilled cheese. Take care of Daddy and Dolly. Mwah. I will. Bye. Bye, Daisy. Bye. I love you. I love you. <laughs> Oh my Sweet. gosh, that couldn't be any more Sweet precious. Angel. So do they mm. come out on the road with you? They Ola? come out, they count out all the time. They're yeah. always on the road. Yeah, I joke and say they don't know any better. They don't. So, <laughs> so there they are all the time. They're always traveling and oh. they're incredible little travelers. Oh my but gosh. But this book so is precious. all about family too yeah. and, and real love and friendship and um, mm. so. That's my Daisy. I love it. I love that she was able to call in. Well, <laughs> here's too. the thing. Um, if you ask me, there is nothing better than Southern cooking. I and agree. this is loaded full of incredible recipes from your family. Yep. Amazing stories. Peach roasted turkey. Oh, Ooh, my gosh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Everything sounds so good. Fresh <laughs> glazed apple cake. Yes, yep. please. Fresh gaze apple cake. <laughs> Can I show y'all real quick? I'm gonna I'm gonna um, dip you some of this pineapple casserole, which okay. is also from the cookbook. But just watch, just look how it comes right out of this pan. Oh, look, so see? easily. It's so easy, and then you can just w wipe it down and clean it up. It's just. It's nonstick. Yeah. It's perfect. Super easy. And that would happen with the cookies. That would happen with the macaroni and cheese. Yes, I'm going to need to taste the, what did you say this, this was? This is pineapple casserole. Oh. I think this might change your life, Carrie. This is in the book? Uh-huh. Okay. What? Oh, my gosh. I know. I can't talk. I know. The pineapple is like, oh, such a surprise. Is that cheese? Oh, yeah, it's cheese. Cheese and pineapple. Cheese, pineapple. A little flour and sugar, a little cheese on top. Well, I already this said that. This did change my life. I know, I know. This, I, I, can, I, know, I can't go back. I can't go back. I need this in my life. I know all it the time. Mm. Oh my gosh. It's yummy. All right. Stay in the ordering process for the, the recipe book. I know that that's very limited. Thank you for sharing that with me. Yeah. Oh, that is so good. All right, um, so many things sold out before our show this afternoon. Um, in fact, we're down to our final 350 of your amazing three-piece bowl set. Now, we have two different colors. Uh, if you want the blue, we have how many? 60. Uh, and then we have the pink as well. These are ceramic. 
They're beautiful. They come with the lids. You can bake in these if you want to. They're only $6 and change to add those to your order. So your item number, 566-648. They're absolutely adorable, but like I said, last call. And then, oh, I love your 14-piece bakeware set. Oh, me too. I love this set. It makes the most beautiful table. It goes from, this, from the oven straight to the table. You don't have to change dishes, dishes at, at all because they're so pretty. They're gorgeous, right? And they're ceramic, they're naturally non-stick. Mm -hmm. They are little workhorses. So we have blue and we have pink in those as well. And they those have are lids. also $20 off. Yes. I'm um, so easy to use and again, so easy to clean up as well. All right, let's head over because we've got more cooking recipes hey, that we want to share with all of you. Um, <laughs> everyone can of course shop the entire collection by going to hsn.com. <gasps> Oh, this is my new stuff. Oh, I'm this. so excited to bring this here. Okay. Ah! We got some it's grits pink. going here. It's all. Oh. They are bubbling. You see that steam? Watch. <laughs> I love this. So this set, the grill pan and the everyday pan come mm -hmm. with um, a lid that fits both pieces. Okay, that's so nice. I know. It's awesome. And it's glass lid and it's vented. You can see exactly what's going on. You don't have to. Sometimes when you have a lid that's fully colored and you have to look under there, oh! It's happening all the time. Uh -huh. This one you can just see right through it. How nice is that? Well, that's your number one selling everyday pan that you will literally use every day. Uh, then you also get the grill pan. The lid is interchangeable. That's the red that Kimberly's cooking on right now. Um, and then, I, I mean, know. just let's just have, how close can we get in and take a moment here? <laughs> this is the set, girls, that you get for yourself and you tell your husband that he can use anything else in the kitchen. Don't touch ah. it. Right? <laughs> that oh. is right. And this ombre pink, it starts a little bit lighter here at the top and gets darker. I feel like pink is the new neutral. There you, know? you go. I really do. <laughs> I feel like it goes in any kitchen, whether you're the most modern of, of decor decorations or down to your grandma's house. Yes. Um, I think it fits in every kitchen. And then red, of course, is the most popular kitchen color. So, um... You know, that's not, you can't go wrong with red I either. Really, I never. Oh, I mean, red is, is one of the top colors that we use in our kitchen. So I really love that you did bring in the red and then that fun color of pink, which is really, really popular, so by the way. This is completely nonstick. Um, so it's got the Whitford Quantum 2 nonstick in there. Okay. And the magic of this pan is that it has little pieces of ceramic in the nonstick. And okay. that's what makes it so nonstick. Um, that's what why things release so easily and um, just come right out. And the cleanup is a breeze. The cleanup on this pan. Again, we're saying dishwasher safe, but it's one of those things that it's kind of funny to take up room in the dishwasher because yes. it's just so easy to clean them. It's also about the even heat conductivity as well. So Absolutely. you'll see everything is just cooked. On this, on this grill pan, you want to heat it up a little bit before you put something in there. And, okay. then, um, and then all it needs is medium heat. It's got such great conductivity and it e heats evenly from side to side. Okay. And you can just leave it on medium heat and, and you're all set. And sometimes, well, you can always wipe it clean. Um, but sometimes you want to put a little bit of oil in there just to increase the longevity of the pan, if, um, which, which helps with that and okay. also performance. But I love, I, I love this set. Oh my goodness, I love it. It comes out at my house every day. Yeah, well they're so beautiful. You'll just keep them on your stove top all, all the time. I appreciate too that they're so lightweight. Like I'm oh. holding the grill pan and this pan weighs next to nothing. That's such a great point. My mother um, has is the best cook I know, but she likes the lighter weight pans because yeah. she can handle them better. Those cast iron pans sometimes can really get out of control. But these are so lightweight and so easy to use and this is a four quart capacity okay. so you can cook for one or two or like a whole family full of people well i love that you're using you're making grits because i always get like kind of a regular stock pot but i know how Look, perfect is and this? I, I just want to show you how these grits are going to come right out of this pan and then there we go that's that's how non-stick it is. Grits stick to everything. everything. <laughs> they stick to everything, but they are not going to stick to this pan. I love that. Not at all. 
So it's an amazing nonstick technology that it's gonna, that's gonna cook evenly from edge to edge. I like that you have your pan to throw your sauces in your grits and things like that, but then you also have your breakfast sausages and things going on over here yes, in the yes, grill. Yes, yes, yes. Um, cleanup yeah. is so easy and they look amazing. Don't that's say, one of the most I'm, exciting things. It's like, it makes you wanna have your girlfriends over for dinner. Doesn't it? And yes. And serve right in these. It, and they're gonna be like, are you kidding me? You have pink? <laughs> you have pink? <laughs> I can't tell you how many girls I hear from that say thank you, thank you, thank you for um, making us a pink pan. They love it. I knew that um, the ladies here at HSN would love this pan. Yeah. I knew you would, and and I'm, we've heard from so many of you already mm -hmm. how much you love it. I'm got, I've got eggs in here that I'm gonna poach and put on top of the grits, but I just wanna Ooh. show you how, not, well, I've got the pan kinda hot, <laughs> but I wanna show you how nonstick this pan is in a minute. I'm just gonna pick them up, because you know, um, look at that. The it egg test. The egg test. There yeah. they go. Yep. <laughs> Flying around in the pan. Yeah. And you you can't get that very easily with a nonstick pan. That is for sure. Yeah, absolutely. Which allows you with the nonstick technology to use less or even no fats and oils yes. and sprays and things if you don't want to use that, right? That's right. It's a much healthier way to cook for our family. So you do get the lid. The lid is interchangeable between the two pans. You choose, and let me give some love to the red here for just a moment because that's a really rich, beautiful. It's such a beautiful red. 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 It's and that red I'll can bring. also be a manly red. So if you've got a man in your family and you don't want him to have pink pans, <laughs> pick up the red for him. I hear from so many men who love this pan, by the way. Oh, is that, I'm not surprised at all. I'm, I'm missing up how everything is. I'm going to show displayed. you. Can I show you how easily this cleans sure. up, by the way? And I got this pan super hot, and and you know there's a lot of burger left in here. But watch. With a little bit of wax in the towel, and you're clean. And I'm gonna stick something else in there now. Look how <laughs> easily that comes clean. It makes me so happy. I know. I like that you can make it, you could make all your favorite meats and get the grill marks. Especially right now, it's so hot. Yeah. And then it's gonna be too cold to grill. It's outside. gonna be too cold soon. But I love it when I can grill indoors and I don't have to go back and forth, back and forth, yeah. in and out, in and out. And I don't have to worry about fighting the bugs. And yep. if I have people in my kitchen, I can hang out with the people in my kitchen. Yay. I don't have to go back and forth outside to the grill. So, um, what are you this, doing? Right now, I'm going to grill some watermelon. Are you really? Because also in my cookbook is um, a prosciutto and watermelon, grilled watermelon salad. Oh my gosh. And so I'm going to grill that watermelon right up and stick it on my salad over here. Okay, that sounds amazing. Mm -hmm. I wanted to show everybody that the cookbook, Ogussie, is still available for you, but it is becoming limited. So you plated the eggs right on top of the grits. Got the eggs right here on top of the grits, and they're coming right out of that pan. And that's a single serving right there. That's, it's a single that's, serving that's, for a big old fork. boy. <laughs> or us. Or us two girls. <laughs> hey, um, Ogussie, why is it called Ogussie? I grew up, and every woman in my family we just always said, oh, Gussie. And we said it when we were excited. Oh, God! And we said it when we were mad. And we said it when, you know, we dropped the biscuits in the floor. Or it, any, we just used it as an exclamation that, that Better was, than the alternative of something else. Better than the alternative. <laughs> and, um, and so when I came to write that cookbook, my friends were like, you have to call it Ogussie oh, because it. you say it all the time. So it's just a very Southern Aww. saying that means whatever you want it to I mean. love that. Well, here's the thing. These amazing inspirations and incredible recipes from Kimberly's family are available in this hand-signed cookbook. Oh, look, I just opened right to the, one of the pages of you look and at, your husband and yes, Daisy. Yes, sweet Daisy. Oh, that's the thing is there's there's stories in here from your family, yes. from Little Big Town. So. All kinds of stories and recipes. And the thing about the cookbook is the recipes are not real difficult. We're working mamas, right? right? We don't have a whole lot of time. We don't have a day to spend in the kitchen cooking. Yeah. So these recipes are very, um, very, very friendly and very forgiving also. You're not going to have to worry about... Um, I'm screwing it with, up. <laughs> you know, I had to worry about screwing it up. That's yeah. right. Um, I'm going to make some, um, I just wiped this out real quick. I had my eggs in it. I gave it one little wipe, and um, I'm going to whip up some girl, what I call girlfriend s'mores. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Starting with a little butter, a little brown sugar, and I'm going to add some chocolate chips in here, oh and some God. graham crackers, and some marshmallows, okay. and talk about a girl party. I mean, I tell you what, <laughs> in your fun grill pans that your girlfriends are just going to be so jealous. That's right. I'm, 
think that these are so adorable. Aren't they so sweet? I love them so much. And um, the thing about this pan, yeah. it cooks so well. When a pan cooks this well and cleans up this fast, it's yeah. the one you're going to go to every day. Absolutely. Um, is the recipe for the, what were you calling it, the girlfriend's? Girlfriend's s'mores. Is that in the book too? It's in the book. Girlfriend's book. It's in the book. I'm going to let that, I'm going to let this brown a little bit more. I turned it down too far. Okay, well let me show everybody the colors again while you're doing that. These truly are uh, the pans that you're going to use every single day in your kitchen because you have that nice big four quart everyday pan. So whether you're cooking eggs, whether you are baking, you can actually bake a, a lasagna or anything you want to right in your oven with this, you're going to use that pan. Then you also get your grill pan. So all of of your meats, your watermelon, as Kimberly is about to show us, you're going to grill right in there. Cook evenly from edge to edge with those beautiful grill marks. And then the third piece is going to be the lid, and the lid is interchangeable between the two. Now, if you want the pink, have you ever seen anything this fabulous? Only a few hundred of the pink remaining. So sweet. Both of the everyday pans have an ombre to them, so that you'll see on the pink that beautiful kind of transition of color there. Serve in these by all means right from by your stove. By all means, you take them from the stove. If you need to put them yeah. in the oven, they're also oven safe up to yep. 450 degrees, so you're totally safe there. Yep. And then take them straight to the table. Don't put them in another pot that you have to wash. Put it right in that, and it'll make your table beautiful. So you added bananas. So I, I added talking. bananas, <gasps> and now I'm going to put the graham crackers on the top. Okay. All around the top. This is also a great one to get the kids involved. I was going to say, do you make this one with Daisy? I and... make this one with Daisy, and we often put them in little mason jars, so we would crumble up the graham crackers in that case. Hmm. Um, but now. It's the big marshmallow. It's the big one. It's the giant marshmallow. Put them on the top, and we <laughs> stick it in the oven for a few minutes to broil, like you would toast on the on the campfire. Oh, I love it. And I'm going to go because HSN is magic. I'm going to go get one out of the oven. Okay. <laughs> Already done. Already. You know what's great is everything that Kimberly put in that pot, from the marshmallows to the sugar to the chocolate. Everything is is so sticky and can be a nightmare to try to clean up. But we'll show you everything releases from this nonstick cookware set so beautifully so it makes cooking and baking so easily or so easy <gasps> here you go there's your girlfriend s'mores. Call the girls yeah, over. Right. <laughs> oh my goodness. Aren't they and pretty? You just threw everything in and popped it in the oven. Yeah, yeah, I did. And now I'm gonna just get it out of here and it's not gonna stick at all. And we've got marshmallows and sugary bananas in here. And this pan is gonna clean up like a dream. Like a dream. I'm looking for a fork. Oh, there's <laughs> forks. <laughs> Thank you. All righty. I'm oh, going to flip let's... over these watermelons. Yeah, pieces. let's take a look back at the watermelons. Now oh, we've got some grill marks my going. Oh gosh. That looks like something that you would find in an amazing restaurant as a really expensive appetizer. I think that grilling watermelon really changes the flavor mm -hmm. and um, it makes it a little more sophisticated. Mm -hmm. And so I love to put it in that salad with the prosciutto and the okay. butter lettuce. Oh, giant marshmallow. You got one in your mouth? <laughs> I'll say something while you chew up your giant marshmallow. I got it. Are, are they intended to be eaten whole? <laughs> <laughs> oh, sure they are. Sure they are. Oh, my gosh. Those are so good. I want you to watch as I... I don't have a clean spoon, so I'm just going to wipe this one off so we don't have chocolatey mac and cheese. But um, No, that sounds good. These, you guys <laughs> bought all of these today. You the silicone sure utensils. I'm so glad you got those home. Um, watch the mac and cheese. Okay. Just come straight away. I'm going to let you get in here real quick. Come straight away from the pan. You're talking about mac and cheese. Oh it's going to fall right away from the pan. Easy. Easy, easy, easy peasy. I could take a little um, rag and wipe it clean, clean as a whistle. Well, and look how much you're able to make because it's the four quart. It's the four quart, Everyday yes. pan, so it's just so convenient to have that size. So you can cook right on the stove top. If you want to take it into the oven, you can definitely do that you as sure well. Um, I'm going to show everybody the pink again because that is going to be our first to sell out this afternoon. Yes, they're beautiful. Yes, they're so fun. Yes, we mentioned that this is the cookware set for
for you. Don't let your husband touch them. <laughs> like, let him have his own. This will be yours, right? I love it. Um, but it has an amazing, latest in technology, non-stick surface yes. that helps you cook evenly from edge to edge. So when you're making something like the watermelon or maybe the meats, look at how it's perfect from edge to edge, yes, right? Yes, it is. And the cleanup, I'm telling you, the cleanup yeah. is going to make you so happy. You're going to get to have much more free time because you clean up these dishes in just a blink and yeah. move on to the more important stuff. Exactly. Like eating it. <laughs> like eating it, that's um, right. So the value on this, I want to point that, uh, point that out. This is a customer pick, you guys, it's $79.95. So you're saving a full $20 off. We've also got it on Flex, so you can get it home for under $15. Have fun with this one, but also up your game in the kitchen by being a better chef. Save time. Look, look, look at look, that. Look, that, that was really stuck on there. And yeah. um, it's coming right up. With a, with a wet towel. With a little wet towel, <laughs> yes. Right. My, my wet towel has a little bit of chocolate on it, but <laughs> I'm doing my best here. <laughs> now I'm gonna throw um, a little grilled cheese in here. This is my collard green grilled cheese. Um, oh, I saw that in the book. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's surprising. It's surprisingly yummy. You think collard green grilled cheese, but you gotta try this one because I mean, it'll it, change your life too, Miss Carrie. I love it. I've, my life was already changed once because I had pineapple <laughs> with cheese on it that's and it right, was so that's good. Right. Um, so what did you take, an English muffin? And we got an English muffin, we got a piece of um, Swiss cheese, a tomato in there, and um, the some collard, collard greens. greens. Mm -hmm. Yep, and we're gonna toast it right up in this grill pan. That's so fun. Yeah, melt that cheese. I love the idea of when it starts to get colder outside and you make maybe some grilled cheese or the collard green grilled cheese and yes. in your everyday pan make some tomato soup. Yes, and that's the thing about this pan. It's so versatile. You yeah. can make anything in it. The other night I made a cake. I wanted to know if a cake recipe would fit in this four quart pan and yeah. it sure did. And it made, it was so beautiful and so moist and so yummy. Yeah. I, I made it like at 1030. I was like, Hmm, wonder if I can get a cake in this pan. So, <laughs> so I tried it out and I sure did. It will it will cook on the stovetop or bake in the oven. Anything you need it to. Oh my god. I bet your husband and your kids love when you get one of those hankerins. I'm gonna make a cake. It's in dirty. <laughs> Daisy <laughs> gets like, those yeah. more than I do, actually. She's like, Mommy, I know it's bedtime, but could we make some cookies? I love it. <laughs> Absolutely. Um, but you know what's great is whether you melted the butter and the sugar or you are browning a, a, a roast or meat to put in there yes. and then put it right in the oven to bake in the same pan. In the same pan. Yeah. And then, yeah, you're, and you can even mix in here and then throw it in the oven and yeah. you, you got lots less to clean up. Absolutely. You can put them in the dishwasher if you want to, but you really don't need to. You can see how easily Kimberly is just wiping them clean. This is the pink. Oh, no. Notice they both have a beautiful ombre uh, yes, look to them. Yes, they do. They have they beautiful, I love how it goes from light to, to darker pink. Yeah. I love that. And also remember that the lid that you're getting in this three-piece set fits both the grill pan and also the everyday pan. Yeah. And it's the vented glass and the double um, riveted handles. Also, when you have a lot going on on your stovetop, which I often do, mm -hmm. you don't have long the long stem handles that are going to get in your way. So, um, so let's say we have one right here. We can we can nestle a lot of these in here and not worry about those handles that we might have to juggle all over the place. That's I a good love point. these handles. Yeah. Um, really comfortable, easy grip. So if you are carrying them from the stovetop to the oven, um, you know you have uh, you know you have that that level of comfort there, which yeah. is so nice. Yeah. So that was the pink. We do still have the red available. Over 300 gone. If you want the pink, it's going to be your first to go at only $14.99. What a fabulous gift to give to somebody getting married or moving into their first place. Oh, listen, and what makes what these pans are so special. Another thing I keep talking about how special they are, mm -hmm. but they're they're user friendly and they're forgiven. So they're yeah. great for people who are just learning how to cook, like college kids or yeah. newly married folks who are just learn just just getting it in, you know, just getting the hang of it. Um, it's perfect for them. Yeah, it's so affordable. I think so too. For this, for this nonstick technology, for this even heat conductivity, and let's talk about that for a second because oh, yes. a lot of times we will cook meats or we will try to you know prepare something and you flip it over. 
And it's like mm. you've got it, you've got something cooked on one edge yes, and not so yes. much on the other. This pan, these both of these pans conduct heat so well and eat up uh, heat up so evenly. You're not going to have that trouble whatsoever. Well, we only have a few minutes left to share this with you. By the way, this is Kimberly's last show. Yeah, it's um, my last show for but, now. But if you want more Kimberly Schlappman of Little Big Town, we are going to have a Facebook Live coming yes. up at four o'clock. So make sure you join us on HSN's Facebook page. So we have a few minutes left. What is spaghetti pie? We're okay, gonna... <laughs> spaghetti. Pie. Are we going to mix this up right now? Let's do it. All We've right. got about five minutes. Okay. So, you know what? I'm going to mix it up in one of our Your beautiful bowls. bowls. You know what? Why, yeah. don't we just, why don't we just mix it up in the everyday pan? Sure. Because this is what I would do at my house. Okay. First of all, we are going to get some fennel going. My recipe has fennel in it. This recipe came from my mother-in-law. Okay. And, um... It's in there. It's called Donna's Spaghetti Casserole. Mm -hmm, yes. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So I'm going to start out just grilling some onions. Okay. First of all. And then we'll pour this fennel in here um, and just grill these up together. Fennel gives it a little bit of sweetness and such great, great flavor. So we don't have any oil in this pan. We're okay, going to get it going. I had turned it. It's, it. it's not warm yet, so we'll have to wait for it a minute. So we'll have to pretend like that's <laughs> sautéing up because yep. I didn't have a pan ready. And then we'll throw in our um, our mushrooms okay. with that. There's, look at how much you're able to throw in there. Look at there. I know. Yeah. So there's a little meatiness for us. And then our spaghetti noodles. This is a meatless spaghetti. Now, you can always okay. add meat to it, but we're, I'm going to throw in my spaghetti noodles, and I hope there we go. See, it's so nice to have. So, such so you a just large layer it pan. right up. Okay. Yeah, and it's all gonna fit in this pan, and this is a lot of noodles. <laughs> <laughs> that is and a it's lot all fitting in there. Noodles. That's like a few boxes of noodles, <laughs> and then we're gonna top it. There's a lot of crew here that with, wants to eat your recipe. That's good. <laughs> we're gonna top it with cheese. Okay. And so this has been we've prepped right here in this pan, and then this will go straight into the oven some pretties on top, some of that fennel on top of there. So whatever it is you're preparing, you can go right from the stove top, right into the oven up to 450 degrees. Then when you take these incredible recipes that you got out of Ogussy, Kimberly's uh, recipe cookbook, um, you're gonna present right at your table, either in the red or that amazing pink with yes. the ombre, gorgeous. And the presentation is just second to none. Thank love you. that. I love it. Okay, well stay in the ordering process for that by all means. So you get that number one selling four quart everyday pan. You get the griddle, you get the lid that's interchangeable. Uh, these are so fun, but remember, for the price to get this level of nonstick, to be cooking evenly from edge to edge, we know you're gonna love these so yes, much. Oh yeah, let's I kind of forgot yeah. about our grilled cheese over here, but there you go. And even Food though maker. I let them go a little bit too far, it's going to clean up like a whip. And I would, I mean, that's perfectly done. That's pro <laughs> I love perfect. when it's, it's a little crispy, It's pretty right? perfect. It's going to be crispy. <laughs> this pan also, it gives such a great crispiness, yes. which I love. Anytime I grill a sandwich, I want it to be crispy. I can't wait to try that. Well, yes. that recipe, along with so many more, are in the limited edition hand-signed cookbook from Kimberly Chapman. So ask your representative about that. Also, you can shop the entire collection on H. HSN.com. In fact, we have just the everyday pan available for you, and that's actually in four colors. It is in the red, it is in the pink, and then we also have teal and silver. That's so the three quart. That's the three quart. That's quarter, the three quart. That's yeah. the smaller. Uh -huh, that's a little bit smaller. Uh -huh. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but it's also in a great price break. Yes, $29.95, and, and you can get it on Flex for $7 and change. Wow. And then don't forget, we have the three-piece bowl set, which can we show everybody live now? Um, these are... Amazing. These are so adorable. I'm like, in, these are like my children. I'm so in love with them. I also want to show how they nest so easily. You nice. think they're three big bowls, but they'll fit right in your cabinet because they fit right in there together. See, that's it. All and they, lids. they all have lids. Yeah. They can go in the refrigerator, the freezer, the dishwasher. These make me so happy. You have to get them. I, I mean, they, they look like something that your grandmother handed down. I know. Down, right? I know. They're, they're, yes, they're very special. They're beautiful. They're final quantity. They are, they're only $24.95 for all three pieces, and they are still on four flexible payments. And then don't forget, we have the cookbook hand-signed, not only with amazing recipes that Kimberly has, has shared with us from her family, but also great stories from you, um, from a year um Little Big Town I, stories, I yes, should say. I'm like, absolutely. I don't want to say that. I'm sorry, <laughs> my adventures in Little Big 
job. <laughs> there you go. Yes, there you go. <laughs> um, but also great pictures and stories with your family. I mean, this is really exciting, uh, but very limited. So ask your representative about that. Kimberly, oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. Thank Bye. you, Carrie. It was Thank fun. Thank you so much. Absolutely. Now remember, you can shop the entire collection by going to hsn.com. And don't forget, we've got a big Facebook Live. So if you've got questions or comments that you want to yeah. ask Kimberly, go to HSN's Facebook page. That's going to happen at 4 o'clock. So we will see you then. Just a few minutes. I know. Thank Yay, you so thank much. Thank you, Carrie. All right. We'll go to hsn.com again and shop the collection. You can enjoy four flexible payments on Kimberly's line. And then while you're there, we've got hot items for you to check out as well, like the Bose Quiet Comfort Noise Canceling Headphones. Those are $50 off. And of course, we love Bose te technology, don't we? So get those home with free shipping and handling and only $59.99 on your charge card. With fabulous offer there. 578-052 is your item number. So all you have to do is go to hsn.com, type in hot item. You will find the Bose quiet comfort noise canceling headphones too, uh, as well as all of our other hot items that we're constantly updating for you. So make sure you log on and check that out. All right. Um, so much fun in the kitchen. Don't forget, go to HSN's Facebook page in about an hour with all of your questions and comments from little big or for little big towns, Kimberly Schlappman, because we're going to be hanging out there live with you. So we will see you then and stay right here because I see that Lynn is standing by with another look at our very best buy of the day. We'll see you soon. Well, we want to welcome you to Beekman 1802, the premiere of Happy Plays, all about including the most natural, wonderful ingredients for around the home. And we're anchoring it today with our very best value, and boy, has it been